The third and final method for enrollment is called zero-touch provisioning. Manual provisioning of a new laptop for a new employee is quite costly. It typically involves ISO images, DVDs, and a whole lot of wasted time. It can literally take hours to have the machine set up so that the employees can be productive. Of course, BigVix can automate most of this through OSD, but there really is a faster way with modern client management. Zero-touch provisioning is the ultimate goal for all IT teams. And that's because it saves hundreds of hours of effort, it's a better user experience, and it reduces the opportunity for user error. Let me show you how this works. You've got your BigFix Modern Client Management infrastructure in place. And you've set up zero touch from a process perspective. Most of that has to do with your procurement organization working with authorized resellers to ship devices directly to employees. Once the laptop is plugged into the network and turned on, it will check its serial number against a known list of MDM servers. Your company portal will then point each of those devices to the appropriate modern client management server. Once that communication path is established, it can leverage MDM APIs, MDM policies, payloads, and actions to completely configure the target device. Let's look at a short demo. Let's first have a look at zero-touch provisioning for Mac OS. This is the screen that an end user would see. They simply scroll down and choose their region. They can choose the keyboard layout next. There may be other settings like desktop appearance. All of these things are configurable. This screen tells them that the device is under remote management by their corporation. This information comes from the Apple Business Manager server, and it also includes things like the initial profile configuration for that device. And most importantly, it tells the device which modern client management server is now in charge. The user clicks on continue, and they'll be prompted to enter some personal information. Essentially just an ID and a password. So once that's done, they click on continue. And the rest of the configuration is pretty much zero touch. The device will continue to configure itself. It'll apply the initial policy along with any software that needs to be installed, including the BigFix agent and even additional policies layered on top. When we get to the desktop, we can have a look here to confirm that the device is indeed enrolled in the corporation. And while additional configuration is happening in the background, you'll see there's a new policy being applied here. This one is for certificates. These are especially useful when deploying things like VPN software or Wi-Fi certificates. All of these help to enhance the security of communication between the device and the corporation. This device is now being managed by BigFix Modern Client Management, and that's zero-touch provisioning for Mac OS. Now we're going to cover zero-touch provisioning for Windows 10. Very similar to Mac, the first choice that the user has to make is to pick their region. After they do that, it asks for a keyboard layout. Then the device does a restart, and the next screen they're going to see is an authentication screen where they enter their Azure credentials. That maps this device to that Azure server and a specific MDM server. Next, they're prompted with a message that tells them that this device is being managed by their corporation. They have to acknowledge this message, and once they accept that, the device will take a few more steps in configuration. And one item that we skipped here is the Hello for Business configuration, where you can set up two-factor authentication. We're just going to take you right to the desktop and illustrate how the rest of the configuration is completely automated. Once we get to the desktop, the user will start seeing new applications being installed, essential items like the VPN software that they need to connect back to the corporate network, 
the Big Fix agent, which provides additional command and control of that system. And on top of that, we're also layering on the Microsoft Office Suite. If you go to the Start menu here, you can see that one of the components has already been installed. And this device is logged in to the appropriate Microsoft account to ensure that the rest of the configuration is aligned with this user. So that's zero-touch provisioning for Windows 10.